Suicide Chip Libero, Wimro Gem Glider Man, Freddy, top of the stretch. They're approaching a start. Up and trotting glider man Wimro Gem and Libero are firing out. Freddy is fourth towards the rail suicide ship. They make their way round the turn. Three wide in the early going. They arrive at the opening eight. Libero on the cones will lead it for burial. Wimro Gem is second. Glider man settles up third. Freddy is fourth in the early going. And then the trailer. That is Suicide Shift along the back stretch, approaching the opening quarter to length advantage for Libero. Wimro Gem got away with a two-hole ride. Glider Man will go to the turn, racing third. Freddy's unhurried in fourth, and the trailer, Suicide Shift, is fifth. There's the opening quarter mile in 30. And a one fifth Libero, the fraction center. Wimro Gem comes out of the turn, racing second. Glider Man watching it all third. Freddy's content fourth, and the trailer, Suicide Ship. They're halfway home in the open trot, and LeBarro has a two-length lead there. Wimro Gem is second. There goes Freddy, starting on the outside third. Glider Man riding the rail fourth. Suicide Ship, the trailer, the opening half mile in 101 flat. They approach the 5-8 fold, and an unchallenged leader is LeBarro. Wimro Gem is second. Glider Man third. Freddy is hanging on the outside fourth then the trailer that is suicide ship the three quarters coming next and libero is the leader still by two wimro gem is second freddy on the outside is up to third in at the rail glider man fourth and the trailer fifth suicide ship the three quarters up in one 32 and one and it's the maritime magic man Barrio toying with them this afternoon in the open trot aboard libero wow he's clear by a half a dozen glider man up the inside freddy third libero in the open trot for jill Barrio. glider man was second freddy will finish third two oh three and four Well, Kurt, you talked about it in the pre-race, uh, two back, how, uh, or uh, the last start back at the 12.51 level, this horse was the winner. Went to the open here today and uh, got to the front for Barrio. Freddie came first, but really, Kurt, didn't kick it into gear today, did Freddie? He sure didn't. He uh, missed his uh, trainer, Mark Campbell, here today. Libero shocks him here with the Maritime Magic Man. Barrio has done it in the past, and he does it again here with this trotter. He gets to the front, controls things, 30-1, and one, half 101, and no real... Pressure on this guy here today, 132 and 1. Freddie, he kind of labors in the turns and gets a little rough. I'm not sure if Murner uh, kind of held into him there on the 5 uh, turn, but uh, he just didn't have it here today as uh, Libero jogs in the open, 203 and 4. Glider Man gets up the rail for second, but it's Libero shocking them here in race four at Red Shores. Barrow into the fourth race winner's circle, trotting big Elling six by Cadabra from the Conway Hall Dam, Creamy Mimi, owned by Donna Van Meer, Bowmanville, Ontario, trained by Randy Van Meer, driven to victory by Jill's Barrio in 203 and 4. Libero will capture the open trot at Charlottetown. 